remember. When you're doing these problems, especially for these, yes, we're practicing doing long division. So you need to find your 0. Once you find your 0, take the coefficients. However, please note, ladies and gentlemen, we do not have an x squared, do we? So remember, my polynomial can technically be written like this. Does everybody agree with me? So when writing using synth, remember when long division I said, hey, if you're missing a number, use 0 in front of it right, and include it? That wasn't necessary, but it was very helpful, I think, to do these types of problems. When doing synthetic division, you have to use that place value. So my coefficients are going to be 1, 2, 0, 1, negative 3. Okay. So now let's do synthetic division. Bring down the 1. 1 times 1 is 1. 2 plus 1 is 3. 3 times 1 is 3. 0 plus 3 is 3. 3 times 3 is 3. 3 1 plus 3 is 4. 4 times 1 is 4. That becomes a 1. Right? So I have a remainder of 1, constant, linear, quadratic, cubic. So my final answer is x cubed plus 3x squared plus 3x plus 4 plus my remainder over my divisor. Yes, no, maybe so. 